Jurgen Klopp's long-term future could be in doubt after Fenway Sports Group FSG announced they are open to selling Liverpool. FSG purchased the rights for just 300 million parcelling in October 2010, and it is believed they could recuperate more than 4 billion parcelling from a sale. It's still very early days in the saga, with blue chip investment companies Goldman Sachs and Morgan Stanley overseeing any negotiations and sell. FSG have proceeded over one of the most successful eras in Liverpool's history, winning eight trophies, including their first league title in 30 years, and were responsible for the appointment of club in October 2015. The German won seven of those eight honors. Klopp is one of Liverpool's most popular managers due to his success and positive relationship with supporters. There were concerns he would step down from his role in June 2024, but those worries were quashed in April when he signed a new four-year deal. Yet those concerns are now back on the table. According to The Athletic, Klopp signed a new contract because he was thought FSG would remain as owners of the Liverpool for the long haul. The German has a good working relationship with FSG chief Mike Gordon. Klopp said in 2020, the relationship was exceptional. It was from the first day, actually. From that moment on, we had a very, very good relationship on a professional basis and on a personal basis as well. With Mike, we were closely together. That's how it is. Klopp went on to describe FSG as the best owners I have worked for. He said, it has worked really well. They were my first owners, so I cannot compare them. They are the best owners I have worked for, for sure. There is no problem if things don't happen. You do not need a personal relationship in this business. We have worked brilliantly together. First and foremost, they wanted to support us. Not always at first with money, but with trust and support in the things we do. That was a plan from the first second. It was always clear we finished 8 in 2016. 9 would have been the worst ever, right? There was never doubt, not from that side. I'm pretty sure there was doubt from the outside. But from the owner's side, there was never. They saw the little steps and that helped massively we could make it step by step. It's unclear whether the club would reconsider his position if there is a change of ownership at Liverpool. It's not uncommon to see managers depart if new custodians arrive, such as when Thomas Tuchel was replaced by Graham Potter just months after Todd Bowley's purchase of Chelsea. Klopp is also an outspoken critic of state ownership in football and the upcoming World Cup in Qatar. He recently insisted there are three clubs in world football Paris Saint-Germain, Manchester City and Newcastle who can do what they want financially. There's every chance a state could be interested in purchasing Liverpool. Klopp would not struggle to land another job if he was to leave Merseyside. He's won 12 club honors in management, including the Champions League, Premier League title, and two Bundesliga titles. He is a two-time recipient of FIFA's Best Man's Coach Award.